Today's countdown to Halloween craft is a coffee filter bat. To start off with, I use my black paint to cover my entire clothespin, and it may take a few coats to do this step. So you may need to paint it and then let it dry and go back and paint it one more time. Next, I started coloring my coffee filters. I decided to put it on a plate because it was starting to bleed through into my other areas. And I just did a kind of pie type pattern with my coffee filter. I'm gonna show you two different patterns I did on my coffee filters and how they ended up after I sprayed the water on them. Now when doing this craft, you don't actually need to use a spray bottle. You can just use a cup of water and your fingers to flick it onto your coffee filter. And that way it doesn't get as wet. I do like using the spray bottle just for video purposes. I think it looks better, but I would use a cup and your fingers to flick the water. I think it gets the coffee filter less wet and makes for a better job of the marbling and keeping some of your original design. All right, now it's time to paint our clothespin one more time with the black. And then I went right on to making the face. I just did a two eyes and a smile. And once my coffee filter dried, I folded it into in half and then folded it in half again and started cutting little circles out of my coffee filter. This created the bat's wings and then I put the bat's wings into the clothespin to make my beautiful bat. I hope you had fun making this.